Hey friends and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Jillian and today as you guys can see from the title it is going to be a deep cleaning of my master bathroom. That would take you guys along with me while I cleaned up this master bathroom. I want to do a few things that I usually don't do every single weekend so I thought it would take you guys along with me. So just a really quick before on how my master bathroom was looking before I start cleaning. Abrázame toda la noche, no nos queda mucho tiempo más. No quiero perder lo que queda. So to clean my mirrors, I'll be using the Jaws glass cleaner. I also will be using this on my shower doors, and then I'm just using a microfiber cloth to wipe down my mirrors. I usually clean my bathroom with um, microfiber cloths, but this was the last clean microfiber cloth I could find, so I had to use paper towels for everything else. I don't know. I just really like using microfiber cloths. I think it's better than using paper towels, but unfortunately, they were all dirty. I only had one clean one left. So I did have to go ahead and use a ton of paper towels, which I feel so guilty using, but it had to be done. I had to clean my bathroom and I could not wait to wash the load of um, dirty microfiber cloths. So I'm literally going to be pulling everything out of the shower. Now, I don't always pull out my shower rack every single week. I definitely probably should. I do it every other week. So last weekend when I cleaned my bathroom, I just cleaned around the shower rack. So this week I made sure to remove it and make sure I cleaned behind it and sanitized behind it. And then I think there was like one or two empty bottles that I was able to throw out to make a little more space on that shower rack. So I definitely need to start just taking it down every single single week it's not that big of a deal it's not that much extra work i don't know why i don't do it but yeah so i just took that off and i'm just going to be scrubbing down the entire shower i'm just using a scrub brush i think i bought like last year from target's dollar spot it came in a pack of two and i really love it so i'm just going to scrub down the entire shower and then rinse it out
does anyone else's tub get dusty super quickly for some reason i don't know why but my tub collects so much dust like the dust isn't anywhere else but for some reason it just goes straight to my tub and every time i clean my bathroom every single weekend there's so much dust on there so i can't imagine if i went a week without cleaning the tub i can't even imagine how much dust would be there but yeah i'm just going to wipe down the tub and then get in and scrub it really good i barely ever take baths but my husband sometimes will take baths and then the kids really like to take bubble baths in our bath just because it is larger so they like it that it's deeper so i always make sure to scrub it down really well so that the kids can take their baths in our tub <laughs> So if you guys have not tried these Lysol wands to clean your toilet, I definitely recommend using it. I used to use a regular um, toilet brush, but I hate them. I always would have to replace them like every week. So instead of doing that, I just bought these and the replacements are so affordable. So you just use it one time and you pop it off. And like I said, you buy the replacements and you don't have to worry about buying new brushes or a stinky brush sitting in your bathroom or wherever you guys store it. So definitely recommend recommend that. Now I'm just quickly wiping everything off before I place it back on our bathroom counters. This is another thing that I do not do every single week. I do it like bi-weekly, which is wiping down the bathroom cabinets. So definitely made sure I did it this time around just because there was like some toothpaste splatter and just other stuff that had splattered on our bathroom cabinets. So make sure I wiped it down. I probably should also be doing this every single week, but I do it bi-weekly. Let me know how often you guys wipe down your bathroom cabinets. <laughs> All right, friends, so we're now getting towards the end of my bathroom clean with me. So I just want to jump on here really quickly to say thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and maybe found some motivation from this clean with me. I'm also going to be showing you guys the after. So this is how my bathroom was looking after I was done cleaning. Bathroom rugs are not on the floor just because I do wash those weekly. They are white and gray. So if I don't, you can definitely see the dirt on it. So that was in the washer. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notifications notification bell if you have not already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. I love you guys and I'll see you guys next time.